While doing a side dock for single site hysterectomy, step one is to line up the shoulder through the single site port. This helps the person driving the cart so they know the right angle to come in. This is very important to show them that. The other way you help them is step number two, and that is to pull out that camera arm so that it's all the way out to the sweet spot and it's aligned through the middle of the column with the elbow bent away from the side you're docking. Make sure it's not canted to the right or left, that it's straight up and down as you see in this example. If you do this as they drive this cart in, they know the right um, position to take it to. Then they can stop for a moment and you can rotate. This is step number three, to orient that camera port between the legs so that it's still on the outer sweet spot, error on the side of being on the inside, not the outside of the sweet spot. And now they can finish driving the cart in. It's done. Burp. This is the best time to burp. One-handed, you're pulling the camera cephalad and up. And by doing so, you've done the whole burp without having a, a big hassle. Go ahead and Frankenstein. This is step number four. Frankenstein that arm um, so that you have plenty of room uh, to um, dock over here on the side without a lot of collisions. Go ahead and dock your um, arm number one when you're done. And at this point, you want to go ahead and take that camera arm and turn it to the right just enough to create a space between arm number two and the camera arm. This way, when you rotate over to the left side to operate on the left adnexa, you won't have external collisions. Operating on the right side doesn't really give you collisions unless you go way up high. It's that left side that you see my hand showing. And here's a depiction of when that collision occurs. You'll see it right there. That's where it's hitting up high. And that limits the range of motion on the left side with the side dock. Um, it's not quite as effective as a center dock. However, the motion is adequate to do most hysterectomies.